Hello guys, my name is Dimitri. My name is Daniel. Hi, I'm Nick. I'm Emiliano. My name is Victor. I'm gonna be your tour guide for today. This was the end of the city. You can see the scripted statues of Peter and Paul in the middle of the gate. And now we're gonna symbolically enter Rome. One of the reasons why I decided to live in Rome is because of this structure that we're going to see next, the Pantheon. The world's largest freestanding solid concrete dome that still exists in the world today. So the entire palace belongs to one of the wealthiest families in Rome, the Borghese's. Inside the palace there is a hidden huge square protected of course with the Italian military. We can still go and check it guys, don't mind the people with the M16. As we look at the square of Piazza Navona, you'll notice the construction of this square is shaped like the stadium at one time used for the Roman Olympic Games. At Ponte San Angelo, we can see 10 marvelous statues by Benini as he tells us his interpretation of the Passion of Christ. We can see in many areas of the city layers of history overlapping from antiquity to modern times, expressing why Rome is one of the most special cities in the world. 